All right, for today's upper body workout, we're going to focus on some single arm strength. Uh, you'll be using your odd object. Today I've got my backpack loaded up. If you've got some dumbbells or kettlebells, that'll be great. Uh, we're going to start with your press. Uh, ideally, we're going to do five to eight reps per side, just kind of depending on what weight you have and how difficult it is for you. Uh, on my backpack, I've got two different options. I can grab this handle right here. We want to get to good rack position, fist below your chin, pressing up over your ears, right back down to your chin, keeping your body nice and stable. We'll do at least five reps. If you can do eight on each side, that's perfect. We'll do both reps on each side before we transition to the next movement. Same thing. Good press, full extension, back to below your chin. Your second one is going to be a one arm bent over row. Uh, you can stabilize with the upper body. You can also use a bench if you like. Uh, since today I'm going to pretend like I don't have a bench or a chair, I'm going to go to a split stance. I will stabilize my shoulders, uh, holding my leg. I'm going to row here. We have 10 per side. I'll do 10 on the right. Then I'll do 10 on the left. On this side. Try to keep your shoulders square, making sure you're not rotating. Next one we're going to do is a single arm curl. 10 reps per side. Uh, you may need to adjust the weight in your bag or your pack, depending on what you're using. Once again, hitting both sides before you transition to your next movement. Next, we're going to go with a tricep extension overhead. So depending on how you have your bag or your weight set up, ideally we'll go back to that press position. We'll take it back behind your head and extending straight up. Behind your head, extending straight up. 10 per side. That's gonna be the end of the strength. We're gonna finish with a one arm uh, high plank. So you'll set up your plank in your high plank position. You'll want your feet nice and wide. And then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna hold my other side and we're gonna stabilize here for your high plank. The goal is to get 30 seconds per side. After you finish the round, uh, to give yourself a break, we're gonna do 90 seconds of jump rope. If you don't have a jump rope, we'll do line hops and we'll go side to side for your 90 seconds. The goal is to complete at least three rounds, no more than five. 